Hi, this is a little demo of the lassoing tool. Uh, the finish will be different. Uh, the parts that we were waiting on uh, didn't arrive today, so um, the finish will be slightly different. There'll be some graphics on it as well. Uh, but essentially, it functions like this. So, nice and compact, so you can fit it even in your drawer or your bag. Um, just undo that and the other one and that's set up just nip them up that's set up for a right handed person for a left handed person you just spin them around the other way around and it works exactly the same okay so spin that off works with pretty much any spool on the market spool the line stick it on and all this is, is to grip the spool. I actually use this uh, as a holder for doing my uh, loops when I'm doing uh, hook lengths on my ZT Pro. Right, so, essentially, you come round, you go round here, round there, and then all the way round, okay? And then all you're doing is you're going through once, and twice that's it okay push that prong up and just trap the line snip that off push it up pull that tight push the prong up and that's it you've got a lasso slide the lasso off nice and smooth finish so you're not going to damage the line and then you use the sizing tool so the top one is 4mm, 6mm, 8mm and 10mm. So if we did 4mm, pull it tight and ease it off. S snip that and there you go, you've got a, a little lasso. Um, done, and then you just peel your line off, the, the required length, ready for your knotless knot. Snip it off, do another one. And what I do is I do a load up and then I'll just go through and do my knot with this knot. Uh, when you're not using it, you can just trap the line there. And then it's, it's there ready. If you want to change spool, dead easy. Just undo that. Take it off. We'll do some with some my favourite line, uh, Comic Stream. So put that on. The thumb wheel. Just locate that. That's it. That's not going to go anywhere. Peel a bit of line off. Same deal. Round. All the way around. And then once, twice, took a bit too much line off there, but you get the idea. Trap the line, snip, pull that off, pull it tight. And then all you do, just pull that tight, like that. Pull it off and then size it. Let's do 6mm this time. So just put that on to 6mm. Pull it tight. And there, you've got it. 6mm lasso. The line was a bit damaged at the end, but you get the idea. So, some people can do it faster with their hands. A lot of people struggle. Well, that's where this comes in. Um, but the ones that can do it by hand you still got to size it so it saves you like, getting pellets out of your bag. You, you can buy this, you'll be able to buy this uh, sizing tool separately and um, you can stick that in your drawer as well. Uh, this will be anodized and the end will still be brass because it's nice and smooth and it's not going to damage your line. So we'll do one more just to show you with some decent line because that last one was a bit damaged so 
over the top there, round, all the way around, and then once, twice, dead simple, push that up, trap the line, cut it, push that over, go. One last two. Let's do this 8 mil now. 8 mil. Let's put it onto the 8 mil ring of the pyramid. And then ease it off. Perfect for an 8 mil pallet. Done. You just snip the tag in. When you've got decent scissors. There you go. Done, then you just cut off. If you've got super long hook lengths you're going to be doing, you just pull that line off and just cut it to your desired length so you're not wasting line. Easy, and then when you're finished, you can either keep it on there and then hold the, trap the line there, or you can spin that off. Take that off there. Put that back on, undo that, like that, and then you just push them in, push them in, like that, there you go, nice, compact, does the job, thank you very much.